Creating wealth is not luck. Creating wealth needs a lot of good habits that will lead you to success. Hi, my name is Japel Hernandez and welcome to Life Talks. Thank you for being here and I hope that you're blessed. Please share this content to people who need abundance and a positive attitude in their life. And my message for today is make money work for you. In all of our lives, what we usually do is we work and, you know, we work for a company, we work for a business, and then money comes back. So it's called Man at Work by Rex Mendoza. What we want is money working for you, and that's growing your wealth. So you earn by working and you make your money work for you. So it's all about habits. You see, money is not our master. Instead, money should be our slave. We should not let money dictate our lives, how we enjoy our situation. Instead, we should make money work for us. In Proverbs, the borrower, it, sorry, in Proverbs, it says the borrower is slave to the lender. Whoever is in debt is um, a slave to the bank company, is a slave to those who um, own the money. So don't be a slave to that. So with that being said, what are bad financial habits? Very, very simple. Um, spending all your money in, in shopping, online shopping, especially during, during crisis, um, we just add to cart all day and everyday pleasures like everyday milk tea there's nothing wrong with milk tea but you know what if you can just have milk tea two times a week or one time a week instead of every single day you buy milk tea um you don't spend for exercise or reading or meditation instead you spend money for things that will not last you forever so those are bad um expensive habits it's, imagine this if you go to the gym and you sinusulit mo, you 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 make it a very good purchase. Everyone, you're not just spending one, two, or three, or four thousand pesos to nothing. You're investing in yourself. You're giving yourself a healthy and fit future. So, um, what I want you to do is let go of the bad habits in your life. Instead, create winning habits. Say it with me: create winning habits. Joko Willink, um, he's a motivational speak speaker. He was a former Navy SEAL. And his, his, the habit that he preaches is, he's not a preacher, but you know, he, anyway. He says, is you wake up 4.30, wake up before everyone is awake, and you start hustling already. He wakes up and works out at 4.30. And you don't need to do that, but you have to create um, certain habits that will work for your life. You need to change your habits and you change your life. Even if you don't, even if you don't feel it at first, but just changing certain things in your day, in your schedules, will create massive success in your life. So focus on creating a habit of growing your career. Create a habit of taking care of yourself so that you can grow your career. So you eat proper food, you rest, you exercise. Create a habit of you know good things, of positive things, instead of just wasting your time, your energy, your effort, and your finances on bad things. So what I love about making money work for you is, you know, what is this? It's when you're asleep or you're in vacation, your investments are working for you. So an active income is your job, your side hustles, all of those are active. Those are you working for money. So you work to make money. What are investments? These are the stock markets, equities, um, forex, or real estate, and you use your money to work for you instead. So these are amazing um, income streams, say to me, income streams. It's way for you to earn and this will help you in your future. It will create wealth. Wealth is not just the money in the bank. It's everything that you have accumulated, achieved, and succeed, um, all the assets you earn and, and the relationships, your network. So you grow it and you grow it and you grow it. Plus, if you're from a third world country, if you have invest investments, this will look good in your visa. So just the practical aspect of it. So, so, so what is money working for you in terms of investments? Um, yeah, so when you're physically working, the companies you're invested in are working as hard 
as well because you're the co-owner of this company. What does it mean? So you're working and you're in the, so nine to five, for example, work from home, whatever, you're working. So you're earning money from the daily chores or the output that you receive. And while you're working, so you're invested in another company, right? Or different companies. As you are invested, all these companies, all their employees are working for you. So I prefer, my preferred investment way is through the stock market or index funds. And, and what's happening when you're busy working, there are multitudes of employees working to make your money as well. Why? Because as a shareholder of that company, you are a co-owner. Say it to me, co-owner. So if you have, um, you have shares in BDO, I'm a co-owner of BDO. If you have shares in Jollibee, I'm a co-owner of Jollibee. If you have shares in Apple, I'm a co-owner of Apple. As you are working hard in your everyday active life, active job, your income, your money is working to you know, make you more money. So that's really amazing. Why? To be selfish? No. So you can share it to others. You can share it to the next generation. Um, for example, you know, like the other day, I realized as I am sleeping, you know, there's internet um, growing, they're still using, and there are technicians taking care of our internet. And what is that? That is my money working. And that's amazing. So if you have long-term investments, you won't be worried in your retirement, and you'll be confident in trying to take more risks. Like you can you can do more things. Why? Because you have already created a habit in your life to succeed to make you more wealth. So, so what is this new habit I'm gonna ask you to do? Um, it's gonna, you know, give you a better life, a more comfortable life, a more generous life. So, if you do this, you make your money work for you. You're gonna be focus, focus on your career because you have something na nakatago. You can spend more time with loved ones. You won't be afraid to take leaves and go into family vacations because you know your money's working for you even if you're in vacation. You let your money grow and you just, you know, you know, deal with the 70% that you have right now and you can practice delayed gratification. A lot of people become poor even if they're VPs or CEOs. Why? Because they pra practice instant gratification or sometimes wala pa nga yung success they already spend. So what I want you to do is, you know, cr creating this habit of investments, of, of patience, it's creating delayed gratification. You only spend after 10, 20 years, and by the time you probably lose excitement. You see a lot of people, when they get promoted, oh, I got promoted, I deserve a new iPhone. Wala pa nga yung salary from that, um, from that promotion. You're already spending money you don't have. So what I want you to do is delay gratification. And this is a good habit for success because when your money is working for you, you're practicing also delayed gratification. And then when there's a crisis, you, you don't sell your investments. You just let it sleep and then you just get, let it grow again. So my dear friends, I encourage you, make money work for you. Instead of, for example, um, buying milk tea 10 times a day, you invest in a company that makes milk tea. And, you know, you make people make you money, right? So and that's going to be cool. So, yeah. So start investing right now. Um, I'm not representing any brokerage or any company or any investment um, brand. But, yeah, just look for a reputable one. Message me so I can give you a straight, unbiased answer. And, yeah, just or if you're afraid, just um, start an index fund. It's going to invest in the top 30 companies in the Philippines or wherever you are, whatever the index fund in your country is. It's going to be amazing. So today, make money work for you. And I pray that God will bless you more and you will live an abundant life. The best is yet to come. And thank you for watching today's Life Talks. And just in case you want to support our ministry and what we're doing as we're helping a lot of people, you can donate any amount to www.feastortigasdistrict.com slash give. Anything that you do, you give, we will be able to help a lot of people. Thank you for watching and God bless you. Have a great week ahead.